Dr. Bob, I'm here at Taiwan Chlorella, and I'm here with my Chlorella crew. These are the guys that make the best Chlorella in the world. I've been selling this stuff close to 25 years now. I've been in business 25 years. Let me tell you something. This is the best. This is the best food you can possibly eat. This is the best source of protein. It's got the highest amount of chlorophyll, the highest amount of nucleic acids. Okay, Dr. Bob, now I'm outside and we're going from in there about one month inside under lights. And now what we do, we come to the first pond. So it stays in here about a week. We go over here, stays in this next bigger pond about another week. We go to the next bigger pond, one more week, and then a bigger pond, maybe another week. It's gonna depend on growing conditions, sunlight, you get a lot of clouds, how hot it is. The best time to go chlorella is in the spring and the fall when it's not too hot, not too cold. And um, we're right in the middle of the summer here. So the total production time is about, about two months. Two months from start to finish and then, then we're ready to harvest off. You gotta open the, the cell wall. We'll talk about all that and show you that later. You can open the cell wall on, on chlorella to be able to get at the nutrients because otherwise, you, you know, your body would never be able to crack that cell wall and get in there and do it. How we do that is very secretive, but it's 100% effective. It's, it's, a, it's a proprietary method, and it's really the best one anyone's come up with. The main thing here, this is one of the biggest ponds, it's the finishing pond, and um, what you got here is, you see, what we want to have is constant motion. You really, you know, you want the, the, the chlorella to be exposed to the, to the sun, um, you know, at an even rate, so everything gets, you know, grows at the same rate, so we've got constant motion, you know. A dead pool is a big problem, so you want to keep motion all the time, and that's how it stays fresh. So you got motion in the middle there, motion on the side, and motion going all the way around it. Very important in Corolla production. Alright, now from, from the ponds, it comes out here, this is really loud, because we're pumping the water from the ponds into here, and now we're going to go ahead and start spray drying this, and, and turn it into a really amazing, beautiful green color. Once we get, we've opened up the cell wall, okay, we do that through pressure differential. Very unique process, proprietary, 100% effective. And then we take it in here. This is a spray dryer. Uh, you, I wouldn't, you wouldn't be able to hear me talking if this was on, so it's not working right now. But this is just the natural way to take chlorella, if you want to think about it. You bring it up to a height, way up in the air, because this thing goes up there like 100 feet. And then they have it sprayed down at not a high temperature, but just to naturally dry it. This is a living uh, chlorella. It's been put under a slide. It's, a, it's um, been magnified 600 times. And what you've got here is what they call a mother cell. So that cell is dividing, and you're going to eventually, if you wait long enough, you see that extra chlorella cell come right out of that one. So that's 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 how chlorella is it produces itself, and it's really pretty amazing. There's really nothing else like it. Now this wall what we've got here is stuck down here. Here's chlorella cells <coughs> magnified, and each one of these is really magnified much higher. This is a dry 
chlorella particle bit, but each one of these little things is a, is a cell. These are all, this is cut open here. These are all cells, and this is the, this is chlorella cell magnified very, very high, a cluster of them. You know, you get, you get a, a million chlorellas. These, this is a, a microalgae. You get a million chlorella cells in the head of a pin. That's how small a chlorella is. And here it is broken open. So now we've cracked the cell and proved that we can crack the cell. And then, um, then this is also a broken cell. Going back down here, we can see the, the chlorella cells, each one of them, they're just magnified. This is your mother cell here. This is what we were looking at on that screen over there. That one's about ready to divide. This one here, you know, chlorella used to be called, now it's called Soracaniana. Uh, it used to be called Pyrenidosa, somebody changed it. But that's another story. But it was, what is Pyrenoid, the Pyrin, was this, this uh, kind of cup right here. Uh, we call it a starchy material, but it's really what gives you so much energy and why you get so much energy from chlorella. It's just really quite, quite amazing. And of course, you can see the nucleus in here and, um, and, and that, uh, in where that part is. It's a huge nucleus for a cell that's that small. And uh, again, just a little bit broad and tighter just to show you just the nucleus. These over here are spirulina. That's a spirulina. That's a, that's a spirulina. After we spray dried it and open the chlorella cell, then what we do is bring it into our laboratory for testing. Make sure this is really contaminant free, doesn't have any heavy metals. Everything is really, really tested very, very carefully. You know, we have a lot of certifications. Uh, we're organic certified, kosher certified. We have uh, ISO 9001, F SSC 22000. Uh, you know, we, we got it all. So all those certifications really are important in, the, in, in showing you what we have. Is, is none of these certifications are easy to get, but it's the testing in the lab in here that allows us to really know with complete confidence that we have an incredible product. Remember, chlorella is the best food on the planet, the healthiest food on the planet, and I'm standing in the place that makes the best chlorella in the world. So I'm always excited about chlorella. Always I love Taiwan chlorella. This is where we tablet the chlorella. Um, you'll see through there, the, these tablets are just kind of coming out one per second. So um, it's a very special machine that makes that tablet. There's no binders, there's no fillers, of course, or anything like that. It just comes down with cold per compression and compresses that tablet right like that. And it just in a second like that, there's, I believe there's 60 of these little pistons going around there. And they're just pick, uh, taking to pump out those, uh, those tablets about one per second, and that's how we make the tablets. In this room in here, this is where we package the tablets and put them into the drums. This is where it starts, and these guys are just some of the team that put this all together.